Hello there, my name is Richard from Silent Peak and welcome to this review of ACDC's Super Resolution. Now I'm busy beavering away on my ACDC Ultimate 2025 review and one of its major features is a Lightroom style Super Resolution, uh, an AI upscaler for enlarging your digital images. And overall it's looking pretty good. And here we go, this is what ACDC AI Super Resolution looks like. Now in terms of controls, there's not much to do. We have an AI strength option, which sort of looks like a sort of detail slash sharpening tool. We have the uh, option of course to specify how large we want to uh, upscale our image. Uh, you can go as far as you like, but the final image must be below 16,000 by 16,000. Once you've done all of that, you hit the button, and then you wait, and then you wait a little bit longer because ACDC AI Super Resolution is one of the slower upscalers I've used, perhaps even the slowest. Um, but it does get there and the results are pretty good. So to find out how good ACDC AI Super Resolution is, uh, we're gonna feed it some test images, beginning with this sort of simple to upscale image of a fur seal full of sort of predictable patterned detail. Next is our super stress test and the destroyer of upscalers, this lighthouse full of unpredictable detail. Finally, we have our portrait test. This will sort of show us just how nuanced uh, the upscaling is and whether or not it can sort of preserve natural features and skin tones. So here is how we are going to test our upscaler. We begin with one of our reference images. We then create a copy and shrink it by 400%. We then take that one quarter sized copy, put it into our upscaler and then enlarge it by 400%, thus restoring our image to the original size. We then compare the upscaled image with the reference image to see just how reliable the upscale is. So here we are, our first test image. On the left, we have our original reference image. On the right, ACDC's Super Res image. And as you can see, ACDC Super Res has produced an incredibly fearful version of the original. Bravo, ACDC. Next up is our stress test. Now, as you can see from the image on the right, ACDC Super Resolution has run out of talent. Uh, the image appears to be quite posterized and overall looking a little bit more like an oil painting than a photograph. But as you will see from the upcoming comparisons, this isn't unusual and many upscalers struggle with this image. And sadly, ACDC Super Resolution is one of them. Now, this is a very impressive result indeed. Uh, we can see here that ACDC Super Resolution has produced an enlargement that's very fearful to the original image. The details look natural, as does the skin tones. This is a very good result indeed. So on to our first comparison, and we might as well start with Lightroom Super Resolution. Here, our first image uh, pretty much looks they're pretty much comparable, aren't they? We can nitpick if we like, but I'm happy to call this a draw. Back to our lighthouse stress test, and as you can see, the Lightroom Super Resolution image looks a little bit better. Overall, I would personally consider a sort of neither image particularly usable, uh, but the Lightroom Super Resolution is ever so slightly less unusable, if that makes any sense at all. For me, ACDC Super Res wins this one. Um, I sort of see a lot of pixelation in the Lightroom Super Resolution image. Uh, it's sort of uh, less detailed and a little more processed looking. Uh, so well done, ACDC. Now we're on to On One Resize AI. And for me, ACDC Super Resolution turns in the more attractive looking image. Uh, the image output from On One Resize AI 2023.5 is just a little bit overbaked for my tastes. As for this image, I prefer the On One Resize AI version. Uh, it features a lot more detail. And while it has its own problems, uh, so long as you're sort of printing small or viewing the image from a, a, a decent distance, I think it could potentially have some use. 
ACDC Super Res does a much better job of the portrait. Uh, on one resize AI sort of heavy handed processing has resulted in some sort of odd looking details, particularly around the eyes. We can see some sort of pixelization uh, in the skin tones. Um, it would be absolutely fine, again, if printed on a smaller size or viewed from a decent distance, but ACDC Super Resolution wins this one. Now, this comparison sort of serves to show us just how good Gigapixel 7 is. Uh, the ACDC Super Resolution image is remarkably faithful to the original photo, while the Gigapixel 7 image is actually better in every way. The image is cleaner and sharper. Now it's possible we might be able to achieve a similar result with ACDC Super Res if we were to add uh, further sharpening and do some extra manipulation, but Gigapixel 7 does it right out of the box. Once again, Gigapixel 7 demonstrates its superiority. Gigapixel 7, along with Topaz Photo AI, are the only upscalers I've tested that can do a half decent job upscaling this particular image. As you can see, the image is well detailed, and although if you look closely, you'll find a few artifacts, uh, you certainly wouldn't see them if you were using the photo sensibly, i.e. not printing too big or not viewing up close with a magnifying glass. This is a great effort for Gigapixel 7, and the reason why I recommend Gigapixel 7 and Topaz Photo AI as the best upscalers on the market today. So Gigapixel, along with its stable mate Topaz Photo AI, uh, is the very best upscaler I have ever used for enlarging portraits. Um, but nonetheless, it's remarkable just how close ACDC Super Resolution gets. Uh, you've got to remember that Super Resolution is a first generation product, whereas Gigapixel has been with us for many years indeed. Uh, so if you are looking to upscale portraits, I strongly recommend Gigapixel, but if you happen to be an ACDC user, you might be just happy to stick with Super Resolution and save a little bit of money. And that concludes our test and comparison. Uh, overall, ACDC Super Resolution is a decent product. Uh, I consider it a solid mid tier upscaler behind um, Topaz Photo AI and Gigapixel, but depending on the image, certainly on par with On One Resize and Lightroom Super Resolution, uh, which is very impressive given that ACDC Super Resolution is a first generation product. Now, if you would like to know a little bit more about ACDC Ultimate, uh, feel free to drop by Silent Peak and check out my written review. If you would like to try ACDC Ultimate out for yourself, you can, and there is a link to your free ACDC Ultimate trial in the description below. Or alternatively, perhaps you're not so much interested in ACDC Ultimate, but looking for the very best AI upscaler there is. And to that end, you should drop by my best AI upscaler comparison article. Here we sort of look at each of the upscalers and uh, look at various samples and how each compares. I'll give you a spoiler though, the best is Topaz Photo AI and Gigapixel. And if you would like to try either of those applications, I will drop in a free trial in the description below. Anyway, I do hope you found that useful. Uh, my name's Richard from Silent Peak, and I wish you a very good day. Bye-bye.